Today, you will produce an error by adding two list view inside column and then you use five approaches to solve the error. Before starting this video, I just want you to subscribe Hussain Amdani channel and also press the bell icon so that you will find the notification of all Flutter solutions. You create new project and change my home page build method by creating two final widget variable with name 1 and 2. Containers with margin, height, text and colors. One has amber and two has pink color. Inside scaffold you create safe area, then column and place widget 1 and 2 inside the children property. You will start by removing 1 and 2 and then create two list view widget inside the column. Add widget 1 to first list view and widget 2 to the second list view. Save your project. You will see the blank screen on preview and exception caught by rendering library inside debug console. You notice that relevant error causing widget was list view. And vertical viewport was given an unlimited amount of vertical space in which to expand. You need to provide constrained height for list view. You provide constrained height by wrapping both list view and containers and set 300 to the container height property. Hit save and error is gone, we have a solution. But sometime you don't like to give up fixed height to solve this problem. Let's remove these containers and produce the same error again. This time you just go to the list view, inside the list view assign shrink wrap property true. hot reload your list view are visible inside the column but now you decide to increase the number of children inside the list view see you get an exception random flex overflowed and yellow bar error showing inside the preview this time the relevant error causing widget was column and the column children height is more than the viewport height. If you make the column scrollable, you can easily increase the column height to fit the list view inside it. So you wrap column around single child scroll view widget and press save to see the error is gone. But you can't able to scroll now. For solving this problem, you just add the physics property of list view to never scrollable physics. Now you can scroll the elements of the column, that's great but you don't want your column to scroll, you want your both list view to scroll independently. For that purpose you remove the single child scroll view widget and never scrollable physics but make sure the shrink wrap is true. Hit save, you have your error again, now wrap both list view inside expanded widget and hit save. Our error is gone and you have both list view scrollable in your entire screen. You can also customize the size of expanded widget which will change the height of the list view accordingly. You go the first expanded widget and assign flex to 1 and second expanded widget the flex value 3 save observe the height of the both list view. You can achieve the same effect by just changing the expanded widget with flexible. You can also assign first list view fixed height constraint and second list view dynamics according to the screen. For that, wrap the first list view with size box and set the height property. You can also use container here. And second list view should be wrapped inside expanded, save and see the two list view inside the column. If you want to motivate me to create more solution videos like this then press the like button and give suggestions in the comment. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.